Hello, it's Zachariah. Hi. Welcome to a late night episode of Zach Reacts. I hope y'all are doing good. I hope you brought popcorn this time because I'm hungry. The first one y'all sent in is called Rotary Randy. It's like an old show for children, but it's not, it's not for the children. Yo, we'll see. Check it out, y'all. <laughs> I feel, like, I feel like a kid again watching TV. Yeah! Maple 9. I guess this is like the, the production company. Remember D? At a tiny school in Canada. Okay. With the students home and bad. The Canadian children. Humble phone named Randy said. Oh shit. While the storm raced overhead. Okay. Hey. When the boat so they, they're, they're going in struck. on this one. At 11.45 Oh The lighting traveled down the wire And brought Randy to life What? Throw Terry Randy So pick up and say hello How about hell no? Can I say that? Ah! <laughs> Bro, he bit The bluebirds <laughs> The fuck am I watching? Oh, Literally. Hey, <laughs> is it that time already? Welcome back, kids. Last time we learned a new word, Kid. didn't we? What's that word? That's happy. right. Happy. Yay. We all know something that makes us happy. That. But you know, watching this video, maybe we don't feel happy. Sometimes we get really scared. Does anybody know how to spell that? A well, it Let's says it. Do it together. Okay, it says it right S there. S C A. R E D. That's right. Scared. Scared. Okay. What are some things that scare us? We asked students in town to send us some drawings. Well, I got a drawing. Right. <laughs> I mean, imagine being a child waking up Saturday morning, turning on the TV. Here's one from Tommy in third grade. Scary, huh? Tom, is that Superfly? This one is from Susan, second grade. Su Bobby Quite does. the artist. Quite. Another fantastic one from Trevor in third grade. What the fuck, Ooh, Trevor? Very scary. Yeah. And here's one from, <laughs> whoa, how did that get in there? It's familiar, <laughs> quite familiar. But why do we get scared? Yeah. Well, you see, a long, long, long time ago, before we had things like TV and pizza, we lived in the wild. Yep, and then the... And you never knew what big, mean animal could that's, eat you. That's how we survived. So it was important to be careful. Look at Being him. scared. Kept us alive. He just wants to hug. Look now, at him, y'all. In our comfortable modern life, there's no danger of being eaten, but our brains still try to find things to be scared of. Well, that is a threat out there. So remember, Probably. kids, all in your head. Okay. There's absolutely nothing to be scared of. Don't be stupid. <laughs> Besides, what? you kids have better <laughs> things to worry about. Like what? Like inflation, okay. Quebec separatists, and our failing economy. Okay. So don't worry, you know. Don't take all this too seriously. It's kind of hard. Oh, shoot. We're out of time. Okay, time to Thanks get the books, y'all. I'm out. Into your I'm home. Not... No, no. I can it, already it... tell we're going to be great friends. In, into my we'll what? We'll be seeing you again very soon. Is that it, motherfucker? Is there, is there anything? Okay, I think that was... And then... I, this next one's called Catch Your Breath, and I feel like I'm still doing that after that last one. This is about a kid whose older brother pressures him into playing this game, and then shit goes south, and apparently you gotta hold your breath. I don't... I'm gonna be holding my breath. We, we can see who's gonna faint first, me or you. Okay, it's, it's a twins. I thought that was Dream right there. Almost shat. Okay, let's see. Are we breaking and entering? Oh, this place is insane. Is you serious? It's disgusting. Just think of all the shit that must have happened here. What, ha oh, what happened here? Really do not yeah. want to. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> you know what, Mike? I don't want to do this anymore. What? Come on, just do it. No, I've changed my mind. You're just gonna pull some stupid prank and make me look like an idiot. I won't, I promise. Come on, everyone at school's talking about this. This is so stupid, there's no way that's real. <sighs> then why are you so scared? What's, I'm scared. what's the game, buddy? It's not real. Okay, then. If I do this, can we please just leave? Yes, I promise. Real quick. I swear, if you do something. I won't do anything. I swear. I swear. Bro, hey, no! Bro's got a trick up his sleeve, you can tell! Fine. What do I have to do? 
It's a try not to laugh challenge for this dude. You need to take these two candles. Mom said I'm not allowed to play with fire. Seriously, Andrew. Bro is, bro is 16 talking about Mom said I'm not. <laughs> Grow up! Take the candles, go upstairs, light them, and then fill up the bath. You want me to take a bath? Everyone wants you to take a bath, but no. Once Damn. the bath is full, turn off the taps and say this rhyme while looking into the water. This sounds a lot like Bloody Mary. It's nothing like Bloody Mary. Oh yeah? How so? Because everyone knows that's bullshit. Just look into the water and say this rhyme. Lady beneath who drowned in this water. Lady beneath who strangled her daughter. Lady beneath whose blood that runs cold. I'll give you life with breath I can't hold. Bro, that's a fucking, that is a bar right there. I mean, Eminem is in a corner somewhere crying. And then what? Once you've said the rhyme, put out one of the candles, then the lady beneath will appear. Bro, looks like Mr. Beast Carl. Okay, this next part's super important. Once you see the lady beneath, hold your breath for one minute. As long as you're holding your breath, she can't get One you. minute?! You hold your breath for one minute, she'll disappear. What, what happens if I can't hold my breath that way? <laughs> I'm not sure exactly. But you're not sure? Just hold your breath, okay? Can you hold your breath for a minute? Let's just get this one. Like up. Nice. I'll be right here. I don't know Wait, if I can. You're not gonna do it with me? No, it only works if you're alone. I don't know about this, Mike. Come on, just stop being a pussy and do it. I told you not to call me that. Yeah, you're right. Sorry. Look, you like Jenny, right? Yeah. Well, think how cool she's gonna think you are when we tell everyone you did this. I don't think Jenny's gonna give a fuck, <laughs> to be honest. Nice. I'll be right here. Okay. And you'll open the door as soon as you hear anything. Of course. Okay. Right, come in, turn around. Turn around, what the fuck? Put your hands behind your back, what the fuck? Okay. All right, cool. Let's into the bathroom. Bye, my loving brother. Love you, buddy. Oh, wait. Light up. Okay. I guess, I mean, let's try not uh, to burn the house down. It's an older house, so. You better not lock that shit behind. Da! A little bit. You jumped a little in your seat, I saw. Your dog moved. What the fuck is he doing? Spot? <laughs> like, why? Like, what's the point? We're breaking into somebody's house. Maybe this is like, does everybody go to this house and play this game or what? I'm still a little lost there. Whose house this is exactly. But I'll let it slide. I'm just gonna go with everybody breaks into this house and comes to this bathtub. But we'll see. I gotta prepare to hold my damn breath. <sighs> Open up your lungs, y'all. Breathe in. That's fucking disgusting! Okay. Lady beneath who drowned in this water. Lady beneath who strangled her daughter. Her daughter. Lady beneath whose blood that runs cold. Hold. I'll give you life with breath I can't hold. hold. When am I gonna hold my... Do I... Am I holding my breath right now? I haven't taken a breath. But I don't know if I'm supposed to hold it. I'm over here talking to y'all. I'm gonna pass out. I had to take a breath! Does it start when she blows the candle out? Because bro's breathing. Yeah, he... Okay. Mike! Yeah. I told you nothing was... Ah, ah. <sighs> so it's because he breathed in? When did it start? Once he blew it out? <laughs> that wasn't a minute! I'd be like, bitch, you're early! <laughs> like, what the fuck? Silent Hill shit. Come on. Puppet combo lighter than crap. Something's in the damn tub. What the fuck? It was the two. The bitch's hair's floating. She's underwater, but regular. Is that a smudge on my screen? 
Okay, I thought I saw the woman, but it's a smudge on my screen. Get your fucking lighter! I can't take my eyes off the monitor. <laughs> Ew! That's a bitch from the deep. Okay. I would slam that door. Just go get your brother, man. Hey, Mike. Michael? I don't. What's his name? That bitch is. No, no, no. She's gonna start on the walls. Look at the hair! Mike! It is Mike. What the fuck? It's like a repressed memory that I didn't know I had. <laughs> the drowned woman. Buddy, a little quicker! I would be like hitting the jets, man! Oh. Are we chilling right now or. Oh, we're playing freeze tag. <laughs> Green light! Oh, we told. your breath ah. <gasps> okay well he fell down the stairs so I'm taking a breath <sighs> this is a fucking nightmare my heart's racing or just broke his back oh here she comes hi listen um, mm -mm. time to, time to, time to hold it. I can't do it. It's going dark. <laughs> yeah, I, I was Bravo sixing there for a minute, genuinely. Just scrape to the ground. I gotta breathe. Can you fucking breathe? <laughs> what the? Did she do what I think she did? What? Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, fuck, fuck, no. Andrew, wake up, please. No. Bro, thinks it's a come game. On, wake up. Andrew, please. He's smiling. Please I'm oh, sorry. Andrew, come on. Andrew. Please. That fuck it. He was Andrew, please, man. Don't die on me, pal. Okay, this next one is an analog horror called The Ugly Duckling. Y'all remember that story? Well, we watched this on stream a couple days back, but I wanted to throw this in here because it's a really good one. So I'll put my reaction and the chat as well so y'all can see that. Uh, but this was this was good. So I'm throwing this in here as well. Enjoy it. The ugly duckling. That's a fucking code for some shit. Hold on, is there any more to this in the in the description? No. Okay. <laughs> That's somebody's phone number. I'm gonna keep watching. Once upon a time, by a peaceful lake, an author swan was laying her eggs. Okay. Little Wait a motherfucking you know. minute. No, they do lay eggs, don't they? Wait. Yeah, they do. Because they're birds. I always forget that they're birds. The big ones, I don't One remember. Her offspring was born different. It was a duckling. Ah, shit. Look at this ugly thing. What the actual what fuck am I looking at? Sorry. <laughs> I just got to back it up a couple frames. Look at this ugly thing. Damn, you see, that's not even cool. That's not even cool. He's uh, and, and he's there chilling. Sit. He's not even, he's not even causing any problems over here being meanies. I do like the animation. The animation is cute. One of the cygnets, as they peered at their sibling. The mother swan looked at the duckling with disgust. This is not one of my children, she said as she <laughs> pushing the Damn! from the nest. You're a freak and you know it. You will never be beautiful. The duckling cried as its family relentlessly shamed it. Do you actually bark? Day after day, the family would mistreat the duckling, making fun of its appearance. Bro, his own mom said, You're a freak. You know what you are. Like, Mom, relax! The swans constantly pointed out their differences, such as their size or beak. Shorty! <laughs> you see that, Shorty? Duck's feathers. Your feathers are plain and gross. Like dirt. 
Really, but only dream of having a cold like ours. What the f- This shit's like dark in a- in like a- in an uh kind of way. Like, I don't- I'm not- The duckling disappeared. Good riddance. Sure, one of the siblings. That runt was tainting our family. He was what? Was tainting our- I don't like that word, tainting. Family. Many suns and many moons passed, and before- Are y'all enjoying- ah! They had all grown into graceful and elegant- Oh shit, they're all growing up! Shit's getting real! Shit is getting it real. It's come time for all of you to find a place of your own. I trust that all of you will be able to have a beautiful family like ours, and for continue sure. our pure bloodline. Hey, this motherfucking ugly dog about okay, to show up. Mother, farewell. They squawk. They He's ending the bloodline. The He's lake. ending the bloodline. Gliding along the water, the swan siblings reminisced about the past. It's a shame, really, said one of the swans. Although he wasn't a looker, it does feel strange that he has left us. So oh, now they're feeling silly. fucking... As if you care what happened to that thing. If you ask me, between his shitty feathers and that weird stare, it's a blessing that he's out of the picture. What the fuck is up with these damn birds, man? Like, are y'all kidding me? You're not all that. They're over here, like, really? Simon, that's horrible. Just because he was a little different, didn't mean we had to be such dicks as kids. Legit. Loosen up, Sylvie. Bro's got a deformity. Besides... Motherfucker, are y'all seeing what I'm seeing in the back? What good does Terry- WHERE DID IT GO?! What good does Terry do now? I'm Whatever, Simon. Mom praising your coat has gotten to your head. It's getting dark. Where is everyone? Seasons passed, and the mother swan decided it was time to reunite with her kids. Disappointed that they never came to visit, she swam the route along the lake that her children once did many moons ago. Guys, this is about to get so fucked up. This is about to get so fucked up. Oh my god. This is good! This is good! It is awfully quiet here, thought Mother Swan, as she passed the reeds of what she assumed would shelter her offspring. She found it odd, now to think of it, that she hadn't heard from her kids after all these years. Turning the bend, she hopped out of the water and made her way to the barn. Simon said he was going to move here, she pondered. I wonder if he's finally got some hatchlings of his own. What's up, madame? Approaching the barnhouse, Mother Swan called out. Simon, Mother is home. There was silence. The door was left to jar. Simon, come on, darling. I want to see how my beautiful boy has. <laughs> You're a freak, an ugly freak. Your feathers, your beak. Good luck trying to keep your perfect family. It will be hard to continue your pure bloodline if everyone is dead. You want to know what I've done? I think you know. I have become beautiful. No one came looking for me when I disappeared. And now, no one will come looking for you. Wait a minute, y'all. I'm sorry. I was not doing a good job commentating. That was not fair use on my part. I was just... <sighs> that shit had me shook. I'm not even gonna lie. That shit had me shook. <laughs> What's up, horoscope? Dude, I I honestly don't know, but this was this was a good one to edit off on. That was hype. I'm not is there more? I don't know. Y'all know horoscope. What's up, bro? That was sick! Dude, when he came in at the end, like this part. I am an You're a freak. An ugly freak. You're we knew it, hey, we called it too. We called it. 
We called it. We called it. We knew, we knew that he was going to take out the entire bloodline. The last horror short film is called Night Visit. Now, this is about a police officer who goes into a house after getting a call. Fuck all. Like, you know what I'm saying? Shit does not go right. Yeah, her name's Heather Feldman. I never called in. They haven't seen her for a month or so. They haven't seen Heather for a month, so we're sending the, uh, the rookie over Please. to check it out. I'm guessing. Probably not a rookie. Police, open up. I'll role play as well. Police! Yeah, we got a 20910. Uh, female uh, is not responding. Door is open. I'm entering the residence. Police, make yourself Hello? known. Isn't that what they say? Right? They have to say that. Police! There it goes. And then, make yourself. He's going to skip over that part. Um, I'm a, I'm a police officer. I'm here to help you. None of your neighbors have seen you for a month. Normally you go out right on that little bike at least once or twice a day at the... Oh, we're listening to music. That's a beautiful record you've got playing. What must I say? How long has that shit been going? Are we just, are we secluded now? Maybe it's Corona time again. Maybe I've got the virus. I'd be like dancing with my gun and shit in the living room. Pop, 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 pop. Like, bro, I'd be going insane. It's a pretty house. Many miles away. Hey. Oh, and you had to ruin my fun, didn't you, man? What? Mrs. Feldman? What do you see, Nick Merckx? <laughs> Y'all watch any? Call it. Fucking Amanda the Adventurer, fucking Jigsaw coming on the John Kramer. Welcome to the game. <sighs> Alright, pal, what's, what's the deal? Oh. Mrs. Fl Bro said Mrs. Was she bald? Ha! What is this? Who, who are these? What the? F We're filming a couple walking down a hotel room hall. Is that supposed to be him? Not interested. Bro, who the fuck sleeps like that? Uh-uh. She's got a she's got a wire. Oh, okay. So what is what is that? She's gonna handcuff him. So Okay. Is that is is she just showing you what's about to happen to you or what the? Are you fucking serious? So, who is this lady? Is this the lady who's right behind me? I'd be like, hey man, listen, I don't, I don't know who. <laughs> okay. So he's got about three more seconds until Jesus shakes his hand. Him and God are shaking right now. He's meeting Jesus. Oh shit, some of the wise men. Oh fuck. He's like, huh. Wait a minute. So is he just chilling there? Who the fuck? Okay, so we're going back and. Okay, is that us coming home now? Oh, now we're recording again. I'm so confused right now. But I'm worried for, for Officer Nick Merck's safety. Long day. Tell me about it. <laughs> hey. Not much of a talker after work, are we, pal? No? Oh my gosh! I don't even want to... <laughs> That's 
that's just not that's just not cool. That's just dark a little bit. What do you want to watch? Um, whatever you want to watch. Something, ha- something happy. Of the Black sea has Probably. made it impossible for Ukraine to deliver. The readings are shifting okay. around so much I can't make heads or tails of what's out there. Can't, can't make heads or tails. Oh, no, not police shows. No, no, I can't. Not right now. Is that, is that what this is? Criminal Minds? Because I, I can't do that. Okay, it's 3.30 in the morning. No, no, it's... Is it about to be 4? What does the clock say? Oh, we're filming. <laughs> is bro trying not to laugh? Is that what that was? Bro, bro, bro found something on TV funny? Okay, Hannah Baker's asleep. Punisher. Time to go out and get some work done, I guess. We're just gonna leave her there, not even carry her to the bed? Like a, like a gentleman? No, we're gonna leave her there cold on the couch. Phil? Phil is his name. Um. Yeah, let's call Phil. Is that kid's name Jash? Y'all see that? <laughs> the fuck is Jash? Uh. Phil, what are you doing? Looking around then. We're looking around like we've never been here before. Who knows? What the fuck? Hey, Phil! Sorry. Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> Babe, what are you doing? Babe, is this is this a prank? This has got to be like a is it like one of those. Everybody freeze. <laughs> She's uh, oh. So this is some um, okay. I I think I get it. So she was she was filming and then and now she was making him kill and then. No, I don't really- Well, I hope y'all enjoyed that episode of Sack Reacts. I sure did, man. Things got a little silly near the end, but that's what makes you smile on the inside. Anyway, secret double handshake. I know y'all miss those sometimes, but we can't give them out every episode. Then it's not a secret. It's just like, oh. It's just that. It's just another one.